I like to go to Disneyland. That is so chocolate bar. I think it's just the, the pure and innocent nature of what Dylan's done that I think has captured people's attention. This was something that came from his heart. It's something that came from his imagination, and it was something that came from his love for a friend. And everything I read in the book means awesome to me. So chocolate bar. This book is dedicated to my friend Jonah. All money made will be donated to the Jonah Ponizarians GSD Fund. Thank you for your help. Jonah has a disorder called glycogen storage disease type 1B, which is one of the rarest forms of glycogen storage disease. His type of GSD affects one in a million people. The one word I would use to describe Dr. Weinstein was, is, is hope. Here at the University of Florida, we have over 40 researchers investigating the complications of this disease and working to try to get a cure. I decided to help Jonah because I felt bad for him. He had to deal with this disease every day and drink cornstarch every two hours, so I wanted to help him and find a cure for him. Making a Difference report tonight is about two young friends, one of whom is facing a big challenge, but working together, they've accomplished something that would be an impressive achievement for any grown-up, never mind a six-year-old. Well, this is such a rare disease that there are no foundations for it. All the work is paid for through donations. It is so beautiful what Dylan has done. He's written a book, and he really wants to help his friend. He was like in first grade, and i never seen a kid write a book that young. Well, Dylan's book, The Chocolate Bar, has been absolutely incredible. That book has raised more money than all medical foundations combined. Dylan's raised almost a half million dollars so far, so I think... Sky's the limit. There's, the sky's the limit. And why stop at a million dollars? So chocolate bar. So between a six-year-old and the University of Florida, it's a pretty cool union. I think it's a beautiful, beautiful thing that not only is the University of Florida acknowledged his hard work and is paying tribute to his hard work, but showing children everywhere that they can make a difference. It has made glycogen storage disease global. Now people have heard of our disease, and if we didn't have chocolate bar, it would have still been something, some rare little disease that nobody had that ever no heard one of. has heard of before. Thank you. You're welcome. Go! <laughs>